Hey guys, it's Aquas Citrimer again and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm really excited to continue the videos with Oculus Quest. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can use this cable right here, which is the cable that comes with the Oculus Quest and how we can use it to connect it to Unity. I'm gonna walk you through how to set it up in the Oculus application, what settings we need to do. Also, I'm gonna show you what I did on the Oculus device. So let's jump into Unity and start looking at it. All right, guys, so according to Oculus, this is supposed to work with the USB 2.0, so I'm going to go ahead and give it a shot. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm going to go ahead and open up the Oculus application. And once we have the Oculus application, I'm going to go into settings, go into beta. Once we're in beta, we're going to be accessing the public test channel, and that's because this is only in test base right now, and I'm going to be joining the public test channel. And now that we're in roll, we should be getting a new update. So it's gonna say a new version of the Oculus required to support your experience. I'm just gonna go ahead and click on update. So now that that is running, I'm just gonna wait until it gets updated and we're gonna to try to run the same simulation that I ran before in the previous video to see if the hand tracking is going to work. All right, now if we go back into it and let me make sure. So it looks like everything is working. At least it says that it's connected. So let me try and see if this is going to work by running this experience. So the next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into Unity and let me see if this experience is going to work as well. So we're just gonna go ahead and click on, and there we go. See if hand tracking is working. And everything seems to be working. I can grab, let's see if I can grab a couple balls in here or maybe throw them in the air. <laughs> it's kind of hard to see because I have the microphone on my way. But yeah, I mean, the hand tracking is working. I'm using the, the cable that comes with the box. So a couple of things that I want you to check is make sure you go to the about page and then go into software update. If you look at the version that we have, that I have right now, it doesn't say that I need an update. So I have the most recent version. Make sure that you have that version as well. So that it doesn't, we don't have a mismatch between versions. Then go into the experimental features. Some of the things that I want you to check here, click on, well, not click on, so actually select better releases. Make sure that you have that selected. Hand tracking that needs to be enabled. And then one feature that they added is they have auto enable hands or controllers. So I have that feature set and it's automatically going to detect what experience, what your experience has. In my case, I'm using hand tracking. So it's enabling that feature for me. So that's basically everything that you need to get going. If you guys have any questions about anything that I just mentioned, please let me know in the comments. Thank you. All right, guys, thank you for watching this video today. I really appreciate your time. And if you have any questions on anything that I just showed you with the Oculus Link cable, which in this case is the USB 2.0, please let me know in the comments. Also, be sure to check out my patreon.com site where I'm providing early access source code. And I'm also showing you what I'm doing behind the scenes. Thank you very much, guys.